Hey everybody, this is Clan Again here, and I'm here with Until I Feel Remastered episode 23. Now, for those who don't know what this series is, basically it's a series where I play a game until I fail. So, in this case, for a Sonic CD, it'll be Until I Die, or it could be other instances where I may lose a race, lose a fight, and so on and so forth. So, anyway, I'm on the settings menu, I'm playing this on the Sonic Origins Plus on the PS5. So, let's uh, go back, and uh, we're going to start a new game. And uh, we'll play as uh, Sonic. Now I'll just skip that cutscene there because I've seen it quite a lot of times. If I was doing a let's play of it or a let's revisit of it, then yes, I'll show it off, but because I've already shown it before, I'll uh, no need really need to see it again. So, anyway, so if I die, then it'll be over. Now, I hope I can carry on the success I had from Intelligent Cube, or Kurushi from episode 22. That'd be amazing if I could do that. Just for an added bonus, I'm going to see if I can maybe get the good futures as well. As well as the time stones. If not, then it doesn't really matter. Oh yeah, of course, yeah, I forgot that Sonic's in this, uh, he's got the, the drop dash from Sonic Mania. Which is uh, pretty cool. I think this is maybe the first time I've shown off the Sonic Origins Plus uh, gameplay on this uh, channel. Okay, I'm not getting the future sign there. Get this though, as well as the machine. There we go. Your future has been created. Oh, come on. There we go. I was about to say, I better not miss the goal ring there. <laughs> if I missed the goal ring, that would have been quite embarrassing. Uh, of course, you can see on the view. Give me a second. Just give me a second. Sorry, I just didn't realize this. If I move that over here, when I, you when we get back to the main gameplay and the main stages, you'll see later on. But there's a coin system as well that uh, that Sonic Origins Plus uses if you're in anniversary mode. As far as I know, I mean, I haven't tried classic mode. I guess in classic mode will give you the lives. Should have stuck with that, honestly. Oh, damn, lost the rings there. Never mind. If I fail in the special stages, then that doesn't count because I said technically if I die in the main stages. Oh, there we go. Didn't realize I cleared that already. But yes, you can see their coin bonus. That'll appear if I get 50,000 points there. So let's see how we get on with the uh, second act. There is a pass down there. Oh nice, we made it in the past already. I usually am never successful with that one. We're trying to get in the past from that sign alone. That's quite surprising. Ah, okay, that's not good. If I died there, that uh, without, if I didn't have any rings there, then the episode would have been over already. <laughs> well, there was a coin monitor up there as well. I think they help you as well if you if you fail at the special stages, so then you have uh, multiple coins to retry the special stages. I'm hoping not to use a single one of them, but if I do, so be it. Oh, what have we got here? Oh yeah, the Metal Sonic uh, hel um, Holocom. Oh, I just realised that I don't have 50 rings, so let me go and remedy that. didn't realise that I didn't have 50 rings there. All the focus of finding the machine and... Lo and behold, no rings. <laughs> hmm. I thought there would have been some rings up there. Oh wait, there's some rings up there. I maybe use the spring from down there. Now get rid of the future. No! Oh, never mind. 
didn't really want to go back to the present. I mean, even though I've destroyed the machine, I didn't really want to go back. But fair enough, I guess. Because it means I lose my shield. Oh, okay, good. Well, I got it back. So I suppose it doesn't matter now that if I don't... Oh, well, there we go. I'm going back to the past again anyway. <laughs> and I'm going to lose my shield yet again. So that was all for nothing, that effort. Oh, there's my shield again. And the moon's bully. <laughs> Oh, it seems like the rings all reset when you're going to a different time period. That's quite interesting. But anyway, I've got all the rings I need. I was going to say to myself, I'm kind of hoping I don't die in this, because uh, that would be like two episodes in a row I could do of this series without, without uh, failing or dying. Missed that one. Got that one though. No. I missed that one. Right, okay, let's see. There is one more. Where is that UFO? I think it's back here. Yeah, there is. Oh wow, that was that was a real. That was a dick move on that UFO was part I was about to get, and I was like, nope, you're not getting me. <laughs> wow. That was unbelievable, eh? <laughs> see if I can use the spring to get him not too high. Oh my god, this UFO just does not want to be destroyed. Well, it's going to be destroyed whether it likes it or not. Oh, fine, right, I'll have to get some extra time. Well, maybe not then. Fine. Right, there we go. There we are, finally. That was a bit un of unexpected delay on my end there to try and get that UFO. I thought for sure that I was going to destroy that UFO without any problems. Sorry about that, just to... As you can see there, over 50,000 got a one coin bonus. And I believe you can use those coins as well to purchase uh, content from the museum in this. Alright, since we've got the good future, let's go and uh, confront Robotnik. Oh, there we go. Nice and easy. Alright. Alright, Palm Tree Panic is done without any problems. And here's uh, Amy. Funnily enough, uh, when I played uh, Sonic Origins Plus, I first played as Amy in Sonic CD. And she was pretty cool in Sonic CD. I to play as her, I, I th actually thought it was quite a nice change. For, for a moment when I was playing, I was expecting to rescue Sonic from Metal Sonic. Now I end up getting losing my shield. Never mind. Oh no! I was going to say, if I lose, if, if I die to those uh, spikes, I'm going to be really embarrassed. There we go. And I do not want to go to the future. Thank you. Right. Oh. oh. I thought I was going to access that monitor in there. I guess maybe not. I think I'm maybe better off not going up there. I seem to be going nowhere. I maybe go this way, at least for now, because I'm thinking of a different act here, aren't I? Oh no! Not good. Just 
get that ring mono right in the middle. Alright, if I do that... That should help me get into the past if I do this. Yep, there we go. I was like doing that trick in that uh, first act of the uh, Collision Chaos to get into the past. Plus all the rings are still intact. Now the machine should be close by. As a matter of fact, it's right here. There we go. Nice. So a good future created there. Now we just need to get the rings for the time stone. And hopefully not lose them along the way. I don't know if it's just me, but see the sound effects that those, uh, when you're normally bouncing off the star platforms, they're my favourite sound effect out of all the class games from the Sonic CD. Right, let's destroy that. Get that shield, because uh, I'll need that, just in case I lose my rings. Or in case I come across an obstacle. I know there will be no more enemies left because I destroyed the generator. Whoa, what the hell? Did you see that there? That looked like a glitch jump there that happened. Alright. Pretty good. If I get the 20 minutes, I'll call it. If I get to 20 minutes without dying, then I'll call it apart. Oh dear, landed in the war, the last twice I landed in the night. Oh god, I landed in that war way too many times. And of course, I've got another UFO who will just not say no to being destroyed. There we go. Good. Three time stones out of seven. Let's see how much further I can progress without dying. And of course, a couple more episodes, it'll be episode 25. I've got something special planned for that episode, and you'll see what that is. I do not want to go to the future, thank you. Right. I didn't even notice I- oh my god, really. I didn't even notice I picked up a future sign there earlier. I'm gonna work my way up here to get that pass sign. Should be almost there. There we go, nice. And using the same method again, I'll be able to get there. Nice. The machine I know is right up there. It's just a matter of getting it. And if I do this again... Oh, I thought that was going to be far enough. I guess not then. Hmm. Just had to work my way back up there again. Okay, there we go. Right. Right, that should be enough momentum, maybe not. Damn. I guess I'm maybe not getting enough momentum as I thought. What I'll maybe try and do is travel a little bit further along here. And then go up here. Or maybe not. Well, that's not going to help either. Hmm. I maybe go back here. 
I know I've done this twice already, but I've got another strategy in mind. Which will be as follows. So if I do that, and then go up here, because there is a platform right here. Yet yeah, this is what I should have done in the first place. If I maybe go all the way back, actually go all the way back, feed that enemy there to give me a bit more breathing room here for how to get this. Oh wait, here we go. I think if I do this, there we go. Now I figured out. And that's a machine destroyed. Nice. Now we're just going to get one more ring and then I can get the time stone at the end. There we go. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Yeah, there's uh, an area here that I need to be careful of. It's not going to kill me, this is just a, a, a nuisance. Myself into a bit of a... Oh wait, there's a spring. And then there should be some spikes. Yeah, there is, are some spikes. That's okay though, because I can easily get past them. Okay, that took me a little bit longer than usual to get through that second act, but I did it. Alright. Now it's time to get the fourth time stone. Or is it, wait, is this a... Yeah, this is fourth time stone, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, god damn it. Didn't realize that was a trap door, trap door area, or gnashing teeth area. Oh, well, I landed in the water again. As a matter of fact, let me. No, I didn't want to do that either. Not at the that direction anyway. No, I wasn't going to make that. Right, there's. These are the only two UFOs left. I have a feeling I'm going to need a time UFO here. Oh, there we go, got one of them there. I missed that, okay right, let's wait for the time UFO to spawn. So I'm going to need it. There it is. Oh, what the hell? Sorry, something went wrong there. I kind of lost control of Sonic there for a second. The Wi-Fi connection went off? Huh. That's weird. Okay, hopefully that doesn't become a problem, but anyway. I was about to get that time UFO, but then all of a sudden something came up. It's like the game's not wanting me to succeed. <laughs> it's like, no, you can't all succeed at this. Oh god, missed it again. Come on. You're gonna go down eventually. There we go. Let's just make sure that everything's okay. Hmm. Weird. Yeah, my Wi-Fi's still okay on my computer and my phone. That must have just been a glitch. I'm not entirely sure what happened there. As a matter of fact, if I press the PS button here... Yeah, everything's okay. Really strange. Anyway, hopefully that doesn't become a big problem or anything. Alright, if I get past this boss without dying, then I think I will call that apart. Oh, I was gonna say, can I maybe. Oh, wow, that was quick. Holy crap. 
And that may have been the quickest I defeated that boss ever. Normally the oh wow and I got the full time bonus as well, 50,000, holy hell. <laughs> I certainly was not expecting that to happen. That's very rare I get a 50,000 time bonus in any classics on the game. Anyway, that will do for this part, so I will see you all again next time for part 2 of uh, Until I Theory Mastered episode 23. So until then folks, I will see you again soon enough and I uh, hope you all have a good day. Till then, take care and see you soon. Bye bye.